church should you win? I'm rolling. I'm Connor Mullins of Passion Fit. We thank you exorbitantly for contributing even the smallest amount of money to our Indiegogo. It really helps out. You're really doing the right thing, helping the small town musicians achieve, achieve their dreams. I can't think of anything more philanthropic than that. So. Being in a band is like full-time job but it pays like a shitty internship um how would you describe the kind of music that we play um i mean it comes from a lot of different directions we can you name any influences yeah we i mean jay retard the pixies link ray uh i mean chuck berry not as like a musical influence but as like a an influence in, on how he like changed music and how he he kind of just did his thing and it ushered in a new era of rock and roll and how that has inspired just hundreds of thousands of musicians and now we're just we're doing what we enjoy and putting our spin on it and I mean I want to I don't want to sound like a, a hipster but like giving it like a genre name is a lot more difficult than you would think being in a band because you have so many influences. I think that's really up to the people that listen to it. So when are you going to quit smoking? <laughs> when you stop bothering. Okay. <laughs> What was the first question I asked you? I don't know. Good question. What is the best part about playing music? I don't know. Just like getting together with all your friends. Doesn't matter where you play, how much money you're playing for. Especially touring. Touring is a lot of fun. Getting to meet new people that are into the same kind of things as you. Why did you uh, decide to call the album Atomic Summer? Uh, it just kind of came to us after we recorded it. It felt right. So what is Atomic Summer? Well, I think scientifically speaking, an Atomic Summer would be something that follows uh, a nuclear winter in which so much fallout is created that it actually blocks out the ozone layer of the sun and plants and animal life are unable to survive. Would you be able to party in the Atomic Summer? You'd melt, and all your beer would get warm, and it just, no, it wouldn't be fun. Oh. Is the West Coast expensive? Yes. Damn. How much is a pack of cigarettes on the West Coast? Like ten bucks. God, man! What are your hopes and expectations for this album? I want to put out the kind of record where you're sitting in a car with your friends, and somebody pipes up and says, Oh, damn, have you heard the new Atomic Summer LP? And everyone else is like, no, nah, and you put it in, everybody kicks out the jams, and you all get laid. What do you think about girls? You're getting a little off topic. <laughs> <laughs> what are some of the difficulties with this project? Um, sometimes disagreeing with other bandmates, even though you're trying to go through the same style. But typically, because you like the band so much, you almost always reach a compromise, and that's always a really good feeling. Do you feel like living in a really tiny town in the middle of nowhere built around a gas station like Crozet hinders your ability to play music at all? It, I feel like it really does. Um... I mean, I've dealt with it for a few years now, and hopefully we'll be able to do some more traveling at the end of summer and get out of here, because the, the music scene around here is It sucks. <laughs> um, I mean, the places around here, there's something. What's one of the most difficult things about putting out an album? Um, putting out our album is actually really fun. We ate pizza, we hung out with some really, really cool dudes. House was kind of dingy. Um, I couldn't find a towel before the guy let me use a shower, so I had to dry off with all my old clothes and put the new clothes on. 
but um, otherwise it's a lot of fun. It can be a little tedious, you know, when you have to re-record certain parts and stuff, but if you really want it to sound good, then you gotta do what you gotta do. Next question. Tell me a little bit about that uh, cutoff shirt that you're wearing that might be flannel too. Uh, I got a flannel button up and cut the sleeves off of it because it looks really awesome.